China's Wu Mingxia became the first diver to win five Olympic gold medals. With her partner, she secured her fifth title in the women's three-meter synchronized event. The Italian pair came away with the silver. A beautiful moment for both girls, but extra special for 31-year-old Tanya Capildo. She's been chasing that Olympic medal for 16 years. Her pursuit began in Sydney 2000, and after coming home from London with two fourth-place finishes, she almost gave up life. Thankfully, Tanya now has some Olympic hardware to add to her already very decorated career. Annabelle Smith dove alongside Madison Keeney to claim the bronze medal for Australia. The Aussie pair had a shaky start and thought they were out of a medal chance by the fourth round, but proven time and time again, anything can happen in diving. The competition is not over until the very last dive. Now moving on to the men. Yesterday, they had their synchronization abilities tested on the 10 meter platform. To anyone that understands diving, it comes as no surprise that the Chinese pair took the goal. It was very well deserved, but reigning Olympic champion David Padaya stood alongside first time Olympian Steele Johnson and put up the fight of their lives to claim a silver for the USA. It was a battle for third place, but the British pair, led by the one and only Tom Daly, excelled under the pressure and pulled off a brilliant final dive to push themselves ahead of Germany and claim the bronze. It's been an exciting two days in the pool already, and I'm certain we're going to see some incredible things over the next two weeks, so stay tuned. The Synchronized Diving event starts at 3pm every day. For Florida Swim Network, I'm Carly Warner.